One interesting little fact that really drives home to me how small atoms are is that in every drop of seawater, there is, on average, about 50 billion atoms of gold. And gold's a very minor contaminant in seawater, and one drop of seawater contains 50 billion atoms of gold. The question that rises here is how many moles of gold is that, and can we use that then to calculate the mass of gold in, in every drop of seawater? So 50 billion is 50 times 10 to the 9 atoms. And one mole is 6.022 times 10 to the 23 atoms for every mole. Eight point three times ten to the negative fourteen moles. So clearly, in every drop of seawater, there is far less than one mole of gold. But how many grams is it? In order to figure that out, we need to find the molar mass of gold. So we go to our periodic table. Here we are. There's gold on the periodic table. Let's zoom in. Gold has a molar mass of 197 daltons per atom, or 197 grams per mole. So 50 billion atoms of gold has a mass of 1.6 times 10 to the negative 11 grams. Not a lot. How can we express that in other units? That would be 1.6 times 10 to the negative 8 milligrams. 1.6 times 10 to the negative 5 micrograms. 1.06 times 10 to the negative 2 nanograms, or 0 0.016 nanograms. Not much. 